Mount Maniac here, and this is what is left. Uh, you can see the elements. Tore it apart, baby. She's gone. Uh, this is the two. What's left of the two bay, three element quad array. Uh, I was running a four bay setup. I took two down. Just down to two. This is what's left of the four bay VHF quad array, and. Uh, they were, they were bi-directional three element quads used on the RF node for All-Star. The link here uh, at the house. Currently I just run one. Uh, this is the beginning stages of the uh, RF sniper. Uh, this is going to be a seven element 12 to 14 DBI quad. Uh, building for the VHF contest. Uh, the six meter uh, is over there. That is complete. Painted it today. And here are all the spreaders. And that's going to be the boom. A uh, piece of one inch PVC conduit. Schedule of whatever. 40, I don't know, 80. Who knows. Um, and let me get over here. What did I do with the... Uh, let me... It must be inside. Uh, show you the paperwork for it. And so I figured you all get a kick out of that. That's uh, what I'm starting with. Uh, nuts, bolts, and pieces. And then I'll be back with the uh, build. K1 GMM 7.3. Okay. This is the build. This is what's going to happen here. Um, so let me get a little closer. You can see what's going on. we got a total of five directors driver and a reflector of course uh, not sure how it's gonna gotta get a friend of mine down here once it's constructed with his analyzer and we'll get it tuned up I have no idea how this thing uh, what I'm gonna have to do to match it but stay tuned uh, this thing should throw a heck of a signal out with uh, 50 watts so we will see k1 GMM 7.3